Hey YouTube, Aquatic Bobs. Uh, just another reef tank update of some new coral I got. So this is a weird 40 gallon tank. I'm currently running the uh, Orphic Atlantic V4 Compacts. Um, you know, they're nice, very nice lights. Um, but I'm not getting that super nice par reading at the top. I mean, it's hard to distribute the light throughout the tank because uh, even at the sand bed, I'm getting, you know, in this part of the tank from about here to here, I'm still getting about 175 par, which is maybe a little bit more than I want on my sand bed. Uh, but towards the top of the tank up here, I'm hitting about 275-ish, but where some of my other acros are on the sides over here and over here, I'm really only getting like 180, 190, maybe 200 in some prime spots. But um, So it's just difficult. I don't really know what to do. I want to be able to get more light uh, in the top here. And I know as they grow out, they're going to reach towards the top, and, and they're going to start picking up higher par levels um, because uh, just up here, it's almost 375 par. So as they grow up, uh, it's going to get it. But uh, anyways, I want to get to it. This is a coral uh, rock flower I got from Aqua SD. And it looks, I mean, it looks nice, but it's nothing like it looked on the website. Originally, it was a $200 rock flower anemone um, and it was half off but yeah I I mean it's still nice I just I don't know if it's really that worth it but the guys at Aquest he hooked me up took care of me um, so still absolutely happy with Aquest thanks guys if you ever watch this video <laughs> um, let's see what we got here this is becoming one of my new favorite pieces my wife's too it's this crazy or ultra crazy rainbow trachea trachophilia pretty nice i did get this uh, my miami chalice let's see if i can get it to focus but it's got this nice green rim on it with bright orange eyes and this was a five dollar acro i just picked up from reef collective yesterday pretty cool shop cool guys friendly big selection stardust chalice chunk excited to see still haven't had this guy that long I know he's got more color and more potential too fathead dendros fed them a little bit today. Non-photosynthetic coral. So you have to feed it at least a few times a week. At least. And you'll know if they're hungry because their mouths will gape open. Chameleon Akin. Look at that. Wow. It's just amazing how God created some of these colors and that it's an actual animal. Like, whoo! Man, is that nice. Some nice blastos. My scoli and spatello. My yellow tang. It's got the white spot in the back. And he's yellow, so he's spatello. Some new zoas. My party pack egg hands. Utter chaos morphs. Mm, those guys aren't open right now. Check out this uh, bizarro. Some nice green growing on them. Mm. 
Yeah, you can see I'm not using a sump. I've talked about it before, but I definitely need to get one. GFO reactor. Hang on back filter that's kind of just a trickle to get water to pass through and collect big particles with the, some floss I have in there. Also, uh, a Biomax. A little hang on back. Chato reactor. Or refugium. Not reactor. Hang on back protein skimmer, which are kind of rare to find a good one that works well. This one's done very well. Worldwide corals, blueberry, acropora. Just not hitting some of the colors of these though. Aqua SD, rainbow millie. I need more light. Although, this guy, uh, we're not going to be able to tell, of course. He just started picking up some nice orange in him. It's the Miami Orchid Acro. And it's about as good as I can get, sorry. But uh, yeah, super nice orange streaks pulling out in him. Walt Disney, this guy is still getting used to my tank. I just got him not too long ago. Looking forward to what he turns out as. Blue Lagoon. Yeah, this uh, iPhone does a good job at getting some of the colors, but yeah, let's see, yeah, it's a little better. Jesus, that girl. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, other than that, here's my frag tank. Just went through a dino outbreak, left it alone, overfed. Added extra nutrients to the tank. Three days later, everything looked way better. I just scraped the glass this morning. But yeah. Well guys, that's what I got for you today. I'm going to be feeding and doing a water change tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I just want to keep posting videos. A uh, friend of ours this morning told me, she was like, You need to post some more videos. Um, I was like, really? If someone watches my YouTube channel? <laughs> cool. Alright, well, guys, if you like it, thumbs up and subscribe, please. I, I love getting more coral. I sell, I trade. Um, I mean, I'll, I'll even ship, too. Uh, if the deal's right, I'm more than fair. Uh, but I just love the hobby. I want to see it grow. I want to see other people come to enjoy it. And appreciate it as well. I've still got a lot to learn. Um, but I've learned a lot. And I, I want to be able to share that too. So, yeah. God bless you all. And Aquatic Bob's out.